channel remember it's next for the next question giving all the updates and giving you everything that you need to know about Qatar what you need to know about the jobs in the Gulf the level of that we definitely need to know you know we don't want to fall in trouble especially when it comes to this country and I told you something that you need to know there is what you call an opportunity and you're right when you come to these Gulf countries yes we talked about what you call the medical fitness yes most of us we've gotten our medicals okay in three working days that's well and good for you there are some people that have not been able to get the opportunity to get their medicals done in the three days yes what am i talking about we're talking about a situation whereby your medical medical results are unfit yes we know most of us when we are coming to these countries we do the medicals from home first of all the first thing that you do is the medicals home Yes, you don't know the hospital that you went to, whether it's a genuine hospital, whether it's the agent who created up your results, you have the medicals. Yes, the medicals will tell you from your country you're okay. You will come here, the medicals will say you are not fine. What could be the problem? The problem could be you or with the agent. Make sure when you're coming from home, do a thorough medical test from what you call a very genuine or unaccredited medical facilities to end up not to be disappointed in one I've seen very many people cry here with the medicals they've redone medicals for three attempts for two attempts pleading and three attempts or two attempts they cannot go past that that means you are medically unfit to work into the country which is most of us we've fallen into trouble in one way or the other we talk about the fitness, the medical fitness test, the QVC, the Qatar visa, visa Center, and the medical reports. Yes, good enough here, you can access the, the medical report online. You can find out whether I'm fit or unfit, whether I need to redo the medicals or not to redo. But let us look at a situation. After the three working days, your results are not yet back. We have what you call, there's one process that's called the medical referrals. It's called the medical referral process. For those people that did not know that word, it's called the medical referral process. What you call the medical referral process is that they need to take for you another chance for you to do the remedicals. Either the situation may be, either they've seen something that is not good with your health that they cannot accommodate, or they've seen something that is so strange, or they've seen something that's not real to human, they have to retake the medicals. And normally what happens, if they're taking for you or they want to take remedicals for you, for something that they've seen that is strange, they have to refer you to the Ministry of Public Health or what you call the Ministry of Health. It is the one that now is going to say this one is fit. After us taking a fair prescription or taking a fair diagnosis or taking a fair analysis or analyzing whatever is given to us, okay, we can let this person stay in the country. But once the report comes from the Minister of Health and they do not understand exactly what is inside you, they will definitely not approve you. You find that some situation, some medical referrals or some medical referrals to some people have even taken more than 25 days, not yet approved. You may be looking for a new visa to come into Qatar, or you may be already in the country and you are waiting for your medicals to be approved to take your QID, which is not. Because before approving the medicals, you will not take the QID or to go the residence permit. So you find that most of the situation, or most of the times, that people have not been or have not been approved because of what you call the medical referrals. They are still trying to analyze your chest. They are still trying to look at your x-rays. They are looking at your blood samples. They've seen something that's not so strange. That's why I normally tell people that as we are coming from this country, uh, our own countries, make sure that the medicals that we have really align and are genuine results, such as to avoid being disappointed in these countries. Because you know they have advanced technology, advanced equipment than we have in our countries. They will take the remedical and they will, do, they will show something else. Then that means it's going to show something else to our countries. And even to those new people that will be coming. Most companies or most companies prefer recruiting people from a different area 
to Africa or to any other area because of the medical problems they normally get from, the medical reports they get from the Qatar Visa Center. So if we have, for example, if it is Africa or Uganda or Kenya, they have very many medical problems, bad, bad reports, pending, deported people because of medicals, they will not want to recruit people from that region. That is what you need to understand. So medical take it very important. If you have any health history, make sure you treat yourself well before. Take the prescription from your country. Take a thorough checkup before you come to this country because you'll get disappointed. Thank you so much. See you again in another, another video. Hope I'm trying to share something that helps you out. Remember, it's next from the next video.